What's up, guys? This is Chris from DraftDashboard.com. Here are my DFS picks for NFL Week 7. Sleeper picks. These picks apply for DraftKings and FanDuel. Before I get started, please drop a like on this video and hit that red subscribe button and hit that bell icon so you don't miss our new videos. Okay, in this video, I'm going to give you some of my top sleeper picks, super low priced and low ownership players that could crush value this week and give your lineup an advantage over the field. These are risky plays, meant for large tournaments only. Don't go all in on any of these guys. They are high risk, high reward picks. And if you stay to the very end after all my picks and after I show you the draft dashboard tools, I'll give you my super secret sleeper pick that no one's talking about. My week seven sleeper pick for quarterback is Joe Flacco, facing the New Orleans Saints, who are the fifth worst defense overall and give up the third most fantasy points to opposing quarterbacks. Flacco is only 5,400 DraftKings salary and 2,100 more on FanDuel. Flacco has had two bad games in a row with only 12 and 13 fantasy points last game, but is primed for a huge game in week seven. Playing at home, Joe Flacco should be able to break 20 plus fantasy points pretty easily in this matchup. Real quick guys, I got great news. For a limited time, we're offering a full 30 day trial to Draft Dashboard. You can try all the tools for NFL, MLB is still going, NBA is right around the corner. This is a great time to get in and try everything for one month. The tools are all about saving research time. You can see the last three games, the fantasy points per game, the targets they got per game so you can see how involved they are in the offense, the rushes they got per game. Seeing all this stuff on one screen helps you save time and make better picks. My week seven sleeper pick for running back is Peyton Barber facing the Cleveland Browns who give up the fifth most fantasy points to opposing running backs. Barber is only 3,800 DraftKings salary and 2,300 more on FanDuel. Amazing DraftKings value if Barber can find the end zone again this week. Barber had 21 fantasy points off 17 touches last game and will look to continue that momentum here in week 7. Before I continue with the picks, I'm excited today because we added a new contest for everyone watching. If you want to enter the drawing for $100 PayPal, all you need to do is like this video, hit that subscribe button, and make a quick comment below to be entered into the drawing. We'll reply to a random comment and let you know that you won, and then we'll send you $100 PayPal. So it's that easy, and we pick a new winner every Saturday and announce them in our video. So get your comment in now so I can add another entry for you. My week seven sleeper pick for wide receiver is Marquise Goodwin. Only 4,600 DraftKings salary and 900 more on FanDuel. Good play on both sites, Marquise Goodwin is CJ Beathard's favorite target, putting up 32 fantasy points on five targets in one rush attempt last week. Goodwin is playing the Rams, who have a good defense, but give up the 10th most fantasy points to opposing wide receivers. San Francisco will no doubt be down in this game trying to catch up, making Marquise Goodwin a deep threat all game long. My week seven sleeper pick for tight end is David Njoku, playing the Tampa Bay Bucks, who are the absolute worst defense overall and give up the absolute most fantasy points to opposing tight ends. I've mentioned this pick a couple times this week, so no one forgets about him. Njoku had 19 fantasy points last game off of 12 targets. He's averaging 7.7 .7 targets per game on the season and should get lots of work versus a bad pass defense here in week seven. If you want to try all these daily fantasy tools for yourself, click the link in the description below this video or just go to draftdashboard.com. You can use our DFS lineup optimizer to build quality lineups using our picks and your own custom player pool. Click the link in the description below this video and try all these daily fantasy tools right now. Thanks so much for watching. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe to this channel and hit that bell icon so you can get instant updates whenever we post a new video. You've unlocked the bonus content. My super secret sleeper pick for week seven is Tyler Gabriel facing the New England Patriots who don't have a great defense. He's playing at home today. He has scored 20, 33, and nine fantasy points in his last three games off of five, seven, and 10 targets. That's amazing production for Tyler Gabriel. Still only 4,700 DraftKings salary and 1,200 more on FanDuel. Thank you so much for watching everyone. If you enjoyed this video, please smickety smash that like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Oh, and please comment below with your favorite player for week seven. I love to hear what you guys have to think. Thanks again and good luck.